after being back in Boston, I love Boston. We had a good group of guys. A little short today with only four guys, but it was a good work. Going to college here, did you ever come to this practice gym at all, or what is it like for you to come in here and kind of work uh, out? Over my three years at BC, during the summertime, I would come up here sometimes and you know play some pick up basketball with some of the Celtics guys. Not all of them, but uh, it's definitely fun being back here. So I'm used to this, kind of used to this place compared to other places. And, being back in Boston is fun. What are you trying to show them that they may not already know, even though they probably know you as well as any prospect in this draft because who you play? I'm just trying to do the same things you know I was doing in college, uh, being aggressive, being the lead scorer, and just trying to translate that to the next level. Uh, you know, being in a setup like this where it's you know certain drills and you know going up against certain guys, they get a better chance. They get a better look at you know the small things and the small details in my game. So I'm just trying to display that. How can big time competition that you faced in the ACC help you with an experience like this? Or does it really factor in? It helps a lot because you know I'm seeing a lot of familiar faces you know throughout you know the Chicago Combine and you know being matched up with Jeremy Grant, Terry, you know, and a few other guys. A lot of guys from the ACC this year. So definitely playing in conference with so many good elite guards is definitely something I'm used to and translate gets to get to these workouts. Are you aware like during the season how often your Celtic scouts are at your home game? Uh, I know I don't know Danny Ainge was there, you know, quite a few times, and obviously seeing those guys is pretty, pretty, pretty easy to notice. And uh, I always saw Celtics scouts there, so probably at every single one of my games, to be honest, especially this last year. Do you, do you think about that? I mean, not, you know, not every college, I guess, is in an NBA city. Yeah, uh, I try to I try to focus on the game, but you know, it's fun seeing you know guys coming out there, you know, evaluate you, and you, know, you just want to play hard and just try to make the most out of it. Do you see yourself as a one or a two at the next level? I've been playing the one, you know, my whole life, and high school in Canada, and prep school, and uh, throughout my college career, I got used to scoring the ball a lot, and you know, I'm pretty comfortable playing two, but you know, my true position is a point guard.